Hello, and welcome to the Daily Orthodox Christian Scripture Reading for the 12th week after Pentecost, Monday. The first reading of the day is from St. Paul's second letter to the Corinthians, chapter 5, verses 10 through 15. Brethren, we must all appear before the judgment seat of Christ, so that each one may receive good or evil, according to what he has done in the body. Therefore, knowing the fear of the Lord, we persuade men, but what we are is known to God, and I hope is known also to your conscience. We are not commending ourselves to you again, but giving you cause to be proud of us, so that you may be able to answer those who pride themselves on a man's position, and not on his heart. For if we are beside ourselves, it is for God. If we are in our right mind, it is for you. For the love of Christ controls us, because we are convinced that one has died for all, therefore all have died. And he died for all, that those who live might live no longer for themselves, but for him who for their sake died and was raised. And today's gospel reading is from Mark chapter 3, verses 13 through 21. At that time, Jesus went up on the mountain and called to him those whom he desired, and they came to him. And he appointed twelve to be with him, and to be sent out to preach and have authority to cast out demons. Simon, whom he surnamed Peter, James the son of Zebedee, and John, the brother of James, who he surnamed Boanerges, that is, sons of thunder, Andrew and Philip and Bartholomew and Matthew and Thomas and James, the son of Alphaeus and Thaddeus and Simon, the Canaanian and Judas Iscariot, who betrayed him. Then he went home and the crowd came together again so that they could not even eat. And when his family heard it, they went out to seize him for people were saying, he is beside himself. Thank you for listening. Let the brightness of the Lord our God be upon us and direct the works of our hands to do good. See you tomorrow.